Hello, when you want to create a product that has variations or options like size or color or which pack to come with, go to your dashboard, get to products, then manage option sets. Uh, we'll create a new one. Option name. This is not going to be seen on the store. It's just for you to know uh, which product is going to use this set. I'm going to use the Dig These Donuts product just as an example. Uh, no, that doesn't come with variations, but I want to make them just for the video purpose. So since this is a product, I'm going to use the variation on. I'm going to name the option name Dig These Donuts. And the option label, this will be what is actually seen on the store by the customer. So if I were a customer and I saw something like choose a color. That would let me know that's something I can click on. Uh, keep this at combo box and just hit insert. Then it will show up here. And you want to edit the items. Now the items are what the actual choices are. So create a new option item. Uh, first one we'll say is pink. And you can leave all of these the same. And another one for blue. Blue. And maybe a third one for green. Okay, so we made a set. We made the choices under that set. Now go to product. And we need to tell the product to use that set. So edit the product, go to option sets, option set 1, click this and change it to be dig these donuts. Now if we update that and refresh, Now they have the choose a color, pink, green, and blue. Now no matter what I choose, the images are all going to be the same, but if you want to have pink be one set of pictures, blue a different set of pictures, for that you will go to images, and under option set images, use a different image on option one changes, so when they change whatever the option is, it'll change the pictures. You'll have to click that and it'll say this is going to erase the pictures that you already have there. Uh, so I'm not actually going to do that because I don't want to mess up a product that already has some. But after there, you click browse, put in a picture here. If you want to add in more pictures you can. Then switch it to be different item. Choose a different picture. Uh, I think that one might be easier to explain. Alright, so after choosing this checkbox, it erases these images and it allows you to add images for blue. So if the customer chooses blue, here's what they're going to see. And it'll be whatever picture you put in product one. So on blue, it's going to be this picture first and then this picture next. If I switch it to green, green is going to be the sock picture. And pink. Now that I've added the images, click update, view product on site. And if I choose color, here 
you know, the song picture for green, and the two pictures for blue, and the two pictures I chose for pink. And that's all it is. You just change these pictures, change the sets, 